Welcome to Moonfire Magic. Um, I thought today that I would show you my astrology board that I made. Um, and I started, it's just a whiteboard. Um, and I started with like a one of those half, like the protractors uh, to make um, this. And it's one that has like a piece attached to it that it's straight that kind of moves. So I was able to do with the same one. I was able to do like I did the inner and then on the, on the protractor. So it looks like this. So like this part is this circle and then the larger part was the larger circle and then I just folded it in half. And then I did, um, these are like 30 degrees apart to get the lines for the houses. So there's 12 houses, uh, starts with Aries, goes around in order, ending with Pisces. So each of the houses has the symbol um, for the Zodiac that belongs in that house. It has the house number. It tells you the information about the Zodiac. It also um, has the planet symbol that rules um, that Zodiacs, like Mars rules Aries. And then it tells you what um, the house represents. Uh, so that's kind of my, um, the basic board. And then the magnets are symbols of all the planets. So I can track where they are at all times. Um, when they're upright, then that means that they're going regular direction. When they're upside down and towards the lower part, that means that they're retrograde. So I can easily look right now and see that, you know, Pluto and Saturn are the two planets that are currently retrograde. Um, and then in the middle here is my information coming up for July, all the, and we have a lot, just looking at that, you can see there's a lot of shifting and moving in July. So I write all the dates up in here, and then I also go through here, like this is moving into here, you know, on, that's actually, I think that's the 22nd. Yes, there should be a line there. <laughs> on the 22nd, this is moving on the 11th, it's moving again. So then I just go and I kind of like, this is a, our, our full moon in Cap, our new moon in Cancer. So it just kind of gives me an overview. And every time I change it, I can snap a picture on my phone. Really easy to keep with me so I can look up what's what. So anyway, I just thought I would share that in case anyone decides that they want to make something like this. Thanks. See you next time.